we know as a nation we are not producing as many scientists, engineers as we once did. If we're going to continue to be a powerful nation, our students have to major in math and science and engineering in college. And what we know is that advanced placement students are more successful in college than students without AP. The National Math and Science Initiative was founded to deal with a growing gap in educational attainment in STEM education. So we look for programs that have academic rigor, produce measurable results, and replicate those on a national scale. The Arkansas Advanced Initiative for Math and Science is a perfect example of how replication of a proven program of success can be achieved. When Arkansas received the National Math and Science Initiative grant, our organization made a conscious decision to prove that any school in this state no matter what the demographics, could be successful with this program if they chose to. And we've proven that. We have changed the culture because students and schools now know that any school and any student who wishes to be successful and works hard enough can be successful with advanced placement or in an AP course. So at the National Math and Science Initiative, we believe that the teacher is central to the success of the student. I am a so much more effective teacher because of the National Math and Science Initiative, because of the training I've received, because of the resources I've been given, and my students have blossomed because of it. That's what this program has done for Eldorado High School. It's raised the rigor to where these kids are successful. I had like 70% of my students that got a qualifying score in the physics exam last year. That's 10% above, above the global mean. The Worcester, Massachusetts public school system, because of that, have embraced our program and we are now operating in four of the seven public schools in the Worcester District with tremendous results. The opportunity provided to us by the National Math and Science Initiative has been a game changer for the state. We are absolutely moving the needle for underrepresented students in the state of Massachusetts. So right away we began with access. That's what's happened here at South is we've completely blown away uh, the old way of thinking about advancing students and taking advanced math and science courses. We just say this is open for anybody. So it's open for you, you, you. You feel like you're ready to take this jump, take the jump, we'll help you. Everybody, no matter what you look like, how much money you have, everyone across the country sits down and takes the exact same test, and you can be part of that. And so when all our kids come out scoring as well or better than suburban kids or kids that aren't involved in, in this type of initiative, we can sit and say, you know what? Kids that people never thought, urban kids, that come from poverty homes in some cases or haven't had the academic background can come, school, concentrate and be successful just like everybody else. This is about when you're ready, step up and we'll give you a hand and pull you up with us. I can't think of another program that makes a big difference than working with the uh, Math and Science Initiative. You know, we all say we go into education to make a difference, and this is one of those examples where it's made a difference. The National Math and Science Initiative has enabled us to better prepare all of our students to be successful. It has better prepared all the teachers who've participated to be better teachers and to make a difference in their children's lives. We're going to continue to expand around the United States and provide these opportunities for all students. We're going to continue to urge public and private partnerships in support of the program. And we would like to see this program instituted in every single high school in the United States.